This is my response video to Laura Leela's uh, video on uh, why are we here, why are we here on YouTube. My motivation for being here is just basically to share ideals. That's all. And, you know, I like to listen to ideals for many years. Well, maybe for the first couple of years when I was on YouTube, I didn't make videos. I just listen to other people's videos. And I saw a lot of interesting things. So I thought, well, you know, I might as well give it a try. So I just wanted to talk out things because I've been talking for a long time before I got on YouTube. You know, I make cassettes. I I used to I don't do this too much anymore. I used to actually have voice recorders, little digital voice recorders, which can hold a lot of stuff. And once it gets full, I have to delete some of the things off of there. But I just talk out ideas. I think about something, something I'll either see in the news or something else, or something I'll see in the video, and I'll talk out something about it. Then I'll listen to it later and see how that ideal sounds. So it's basically, I guess, it, you know, there are a lot of things I would like to have happen. I would like to have people who I could interact with on YouTube, people that I could actually talk to, people that, you know, I can respond to. Sometimes you get people that who really do, you know, interact with you. But I think it's not that important to me. The main thing is just to share ideals. I think sometimes you just have something and you have to get it out, so to speak. You have a thought or an ideal or a perspective or something, just an insight in something. And you just want to say it. And I think those things are important. I think there's a kind of therapy in speaking and talking and listening sometimes to other people. I think it's more than just, you know, why am I making videos? But there's also a why do I even watch videos? I watch them. You know, I, and I like the whole concept of YouTube. I like the fact that you have just ordinary people, not really necessarily professional video people, not news people, because that's all you ever saw in the past. The news all the time, that's all you ever saw. Or somebody who is professional, but just ordinary people. Anybody with a camera can get out there and just simply tell you their life story or tell you what they think or tell you something about how they see a certain philosophy of something. So I want to be a part of that. And I guess that's the thing about it. That's why I wanted to make videos. So that's the thing for me. Now, at the beginning when I first started, I kind of got into this whole thing about the religion thing. Although that's, it's kind of funny because that's not what I really wanted to do. I wanted to talk about something else, but I kind of got just into that. I guess so many things do revolve around religion. and But I'm not interested in a debate. Because I think the debate is silly. You know, the whole, does God exist, does God not exist? I actually think that the question isn't as important as people think it is. I think what's more important is how people get along with each other and how people treat each other. And I think people give too much weight to it. They give too much weight to this whole religious question. Because to me, it doesn't matter if you believe in God or if you're an atheist or whatever. I think what matters is the way you treat other people. I think the other thing to it that I think about is I would like to encourage people to think. To just think about things. To be aware of certain things. To just be, to kind of raise your consciousness about different ways of looking at the world. Listen to different perspectives. And that's what I do. I try to listen to other people. And I try to understand them, even if I don't agree with them. I may not agree with a person, but I do try to understand them. And I would hope that people try to understand what I'm saying. You know, if people understand me, fine. If they don't, that's just, that's just the way life is. And that's the way it's always going to be. I don't think anybody's ever going to be completely understood. Maybe, maybe it's a lot like what Carl Jung said. You know, he said that the worst thing that could ever happen to you is to be completely understood. So maybe that's some truth to that. But uh, my motivation is just basically to share ideals and, and to talk, just to talk out things and to meet interesting people. Because sometimes people, you know, become, you become friends with people on YouTube and you get good conversations. And people send you things and they write to you and stuff like that. So that's part of it. It's just interacting with people. 
you know, I'm not trying to be a big celebrity or a big star on YouTube. I don't, I don't think I'm ever going to put up videos and it's going to get a million views. Although you never know, that might happen. One day I might do something like that. And if it happens, you know, fine. It's not my goal and it's not my purpose. There are some things that aren't your goal or purpose. They're just things that happen coincidentally as a result of just doing things. So that's life. And that's all I have to say about that.